And Michael Jackson recently began world tours in Tokyo. Mick Jagger will be in here tomorrow night to fulfill a promise he made to the Japanese people back in 1986. Tony Tubbs, and there is Tony Tubbs standing behind his trainer, Odell. Now lives in Santa Monica, California, was raised in Cincinnati, Ohio, begins to enter the ring. Three years old, Tubbs has won 25 of 26 fights in career. The only loss, the title loss decision against Tim Witherspoon when he weighed 244 pounds. He has, after claiming to us two days ago, that he would step on the scales at 232. Well, he's talked to talk through all of his expenses. I figure out that that's about... Uh... <laughs> Tony TNT Tubbs, one time, it refers to foreign celebrities who are brought here by the overwhelming economic power of the yen currency, as opposed to... The interesting thing here is we were led to believe that the Japanese fans would view this as to believe they were underneath their impassive masks. Of course, if you have seen Tyson before, you are no socks, just the black trunks, the boots, and the 10 ounce Everlast gloves. Fights with 29 knockouts. He went 12 rounds to a decision twice. This is his sixth title defense. And now, Michael Buffer takes over the mic. And right now, let's go up to our ring announcer, Michael Buffer. Tony TNT Tom! Mike Tyson! You both received instructions earlier in the day, and therefore... Tub says he knows how to fight. Let's see if he really wants to rumble as he says he does. I see Mike Tyson. Go. Mercanti says they're all set, and there's the bell for round one. Tubbs throws the jab, and Tyson responds in time. A lot of fighters find it difficult to uh, set Mike Tyson up because Mike now gives a lot of uh, head movement. For now, it does not look that way. Watch for the left in his body. You see the left jab of Mike Tyson. He started using more consistency. And you can begin to see the startling hand quickness that Tubbs brings. Startling. Well, here with Tubbs, the uppercut. I also know the uppercut of Mike Tyson. Same punch twice, under no. Tyson missed with the left hook. Earlier he had landed a. One minute to go in round one. Tubbs landed a left and ducked away effectively. You know what you do, Sam. There you go. There you go. There you go. You know what you do, Sam. Speed, baby. Speed. Come on. You need to break that rhythm with a jab. Tubbs throwing the uppercut. A lot of people think he will have to be effective. Seconds to go in round one. some hooks and he went to the body as promised remember he told us that nobody has gone to Mike Tyson's body so far okay. the talking in Tubbs's corner was done by trainer Odell Hadley so now Hadley and Rooney and round two begins Tubbs keeping that right hand up because of the left hook of Mike Tyson he steps to the ring but what I see here and Tubbs, Tubbs is pretty much trying to get range. Corner, they told him to drop the right hand. The left hook lands, but he needs to come back with the right hand. There's the right hand, Jim, I earlier about You must give Tyson angles. You can't remain stationary. Hands must the body shot, then the uppercut. Raises the chin up, and then the left hook comes into play. Good uppercut by Tubbs inside. Snap Tyson back. Tubbs has to be very careful. You notice he put both feet together, and that's easy to be knocked down or knocked off balance. He's trying to use his additional weight. Coming up on a minute to go in round two, as have so many of his opponents. Good left hook. Good, good combination by Tubbs. You know, Tubbs just trying to gain respect, and I think he's done that. 
Good left by Tyson. Those real. Those hands. And again, like I stated earlier, Jim, I don't think it's a good idea to change punches with body shot, but you need combinations now. 30 seconds left in the round. Both fighters have had their say here. The punch hurt. Tubbs is hurt. Tubbs is hurt badly. It was in the ring. The fight is over. It's stunning swiftness. And the fans are enjoying. They're showing their appreciation here. The tide of this fight changed within 15 or 20 seconds. Well, that's, that's what a great puncher can do. The boxer is thinking all the time, and the puncher is punching all the time. Um, Tyson hadn't heard about it. Well, Tyson now starting to find his range. That left hook there pretty much did spoke for itself. It's self-explanatory because it was a short and powerful left hook. What was happening, actually, was that Tyson was wearing down Tubbs because Tubbs tried to stay inside and fight Mike Tyson. Once again, that's short left hook. And uh, for those who say Mike is not really one punch knocker outer, I think they need to look at some film. Now in round two. That was the punch against the ropes that really started things off. Heavyweight champion of the world, Iron Mike Tyson. And then as soon as he brought his hand, I saw his eyes and I aimed right for his eyes. Were you thinking about that at all? Did you want to put on a special performance in any way? Not at all, because when I'm in the ring, I'm objective. From the handheld camera angle, which will give you a feel of what it looked like to us from ringside. Remember that Larry Murray, in fact, scored the first round for Tubbs. I thought it was pretty good. Certainly, I thought Tubbs had given an impressive account of himself in round one. The first round, that's the way you fight Mike Tyson. You have to give him angles, jab. You see the jab, how effective it is. Movement, never stationary target, because what happens here, I thought the first round was a pretty good round for Tubbs, although I would have preferred to see a lot of uh, normally body shots wear you down in the later rounds. But then, they're always an exception to the rule because Mike Tyson's body attack, is, he took away what got him to, to the championship. That's the jab, the movement, and his boxing style. There was a good short left inside by... But you also see the power of Mike Tyson because always after Tubbs delivered his combination, Tyson retaliated. He said he would bring. You've got to fight with Mike Tyson, but then you give him a chance to do his thing. Look at the short shots that Mike hits, that crunch and body shots. Not a lot of movement from Tubbs, although Tubbs now is trying to get some respect from Mike Tyson. Uppercut. Here, I see that uh, Tubbs is wobbly. He's ready to go here. Continues now under Kevin Rooney, under the management.